So guys, it's your boy Calo. Today we're going to be talking about a sad topic. Mac Miller did pass away yesterday, September 7th, in his home in Studio City, California. We're going to be going over a couple topics. Why did he do this to himself? A couple, just think about like what caused him to take those steps and take ending his own life. Um, why is there so much hate on Ariana Grande? Um, and see what other celebrities have to say about it. Okay, so yesterday at around 11.51, AM Mac Miller was pronounced dead by the coroner's office. So what I personally think I feel like he was doing those drugs Maybe he did have an addiction even when he was with Ariana. I assume that he was doing His regular dose or whatever he, he takes and he ended up doing too much and now I don't know why Ariana is getting all the hate Because you know like everybody goes through a breakup everybody has a breakup Okay, um did she throw any shade to Mac Miller? No. She didn't go on her tweets and start saying like, oh, and throw like kind of subs to him to make him overthink it. I don't think she had any intentions to give him that pain. I don't think um, she wanted him to do that to himself. I don't think she wanted to hear that her ex-boyfriend was in an overdose and passed away. I guarantee you she's devastated right now. So why is there so much hate? going to her when in the end she was the one who was really caring for him maybe things didn't work out but that doesn't mean ariana was supposed to be this old terrible person caused him to have that overdose so i just feel like the hate towards ariana should kind of die down just because somebody who's already going through that hurt and that pain for losing an ex like that's not something easy because you have like you have history with them and to know that they're gone and then still hear all this hate on, on social media makes it worse for her. In the end, I don't think Ariana Grande caused his death. I don't think she um, was like aiming for him to end his own life. Um, I think it's all an accidental incident where he overdosed on his personal doses. Maybe he's taking something that we don't know about. And now we're assuming that it's Ariana's fault because she broke up with him. Um, so I'm going to read you guys a couple tweets from celebrities, certain celebrities. Chance the Rapper said, I don't know what to say, Mac Miller. Took me on my second tour ever. But beyond helping me launch my career, he was one of the sweetest guys I ever knew. Great man. I love him for real. I'm completely broken. God bless him. That's from Chance the Rapper. Wiz Khalifa says, Praying for Mac's family and that he rest easy. Hashtag PGH. Hashtag 412. Alright, so Haley McMillan said, Mac Miller's death is a tragedy. And the blame directed at Ariana Grande, as I told you guys about, is sick. We blame women for what happens to their exes because we see them as their partners, caretakers, not their equals. We tell men with troubled exes they dodged a bullet or got out while they could. Now, what she's basically trying to say is that, like, as soon as we see, like, a man affected by a relationship, we kind of go, like, seriously, like, as in, like, taking your own life, we immediately attack the ex. We immediately attack the caregiver or their equal half. We immediately attack them. And I don't think that's the way it should have been handled, like, at all. Like, you already know she's going through hurt, so why are you going to go and do that? Alright guys, so basically what I'm trying to say with this video is my ideas on Mac Miller's death, what I feel like happened, and what I feel like is wrong. And what I feel like is wrong, one last recap, is the way that we're coming at Ariana. I think that this was an accident, and I think that he overdosed on his, maybe he's addicted to something. Maybe he has like a heroin addiction, maybe he's addicted to meth, maybe he's addicted to something that we don't know about. Maybe he's covering up on that stuff. And to... Accidentally overdose is common with, with people who are addicted to it. So in the end, addictions are normal. Okay, it's not it's not really a good thing, but I mean it's common to have an addiction nowadays. Um, it could have been an accident. Don't put the blame on Ariana because just because she's an ex, I don't think she should take the heat for it. And just kind of do your research and keep up with updates about what people are saying. And hopefully, I make a second video on this. Alright guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. 
And uh, let me know what kind of content you guys want to see. If you like this video and you want me to go more based off of current events, let me know and I'll do that. Once again, see you guys. Thanks for tuning in.